Martin, great news. Johnny Besto signed a, an extra three years. You must be delighted. Yeah, absolutely. You know, obviously he's been a, a big part of our success in the in the last few years, and um, you know we know he's a extremely talented cricketer. So um, you know, to have him, as you say, signed up for the next three years is great news for us. He's had a tremendous season last year with the bat. Do you think he can continue to develop even further? Yeah, I do. I think you know, I think he's maturing all the time, both as a as a person and a cricketer. So I think you know his best years are yet to come. And um, you know, consistency of performance, you know, particularly at England level, would be what, what he's trying to achieve over the next few years. So, um, you know, I've got great admiration for Johnny and, you know, his talents, um, you know, unbelievable. So hopefully he can fulfil that. And the fact that he's playing in, uh, in South Africa as we speak, he's training at the moment ahead of that first test on Boxing Day. Do you think he's going to play? Well, all the indications are Trevor Bayliss has come out and said, you know, Johnny's kind of holding that position at the minute. So um, you would expect him to start. So, um, you know, hopefully he can take his chance now. And just on another note, Jared Warner and uh, Matthew Waite have signed deals as junior pros. Yeah, again, hopefully progression. You know, obviously we've got a very strong senior group of players at the moment, and you know the challenge for the for the next generation is to be ready to take over when you know the senior players are, are too old to take the field. So, um, you know, hopefully those two will be part of that that next generation. And for those that don't know them, what what do they bring to the, to the team? Well, Jared brings pace. Um, you know, he's genuinely quick bowler. And, uh, and Matthew is an all-rounder, um, you know, who performed really well in the second team last year. So, um, as I say, you know, they're both, um, you know, extremely talented young players, and hopefully they'll fulfil their potential with us. And finally, we keep getting asked: any news on the, on the overseas situation? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're we're, we're close. Um, we're close to getting something done. It's it's going to be a little bit. Um, slightly messy again because of the international fixture lists around the world. Um, but we're pretty close to getting um, you know, who we want. Maybe not for quite as long as we wanted, ideally, but um, you know, hopefully we can make an announcement very soon.